Good morning. What a wonderful day to be in the house of the Lord. Let's take a look at this week's announcements. Well, join us tonight here at 5 p.m. in the sanctuary as we meet once again to cry out to God to bring revival to our town, our community, to our church, and to our families. And so this coming weekend, October 7th and 8th, we're having our fall revival. So this is the last time we get to gather as a church that God would move during that time, that he would bring lost sinners to repentance, that he would prepare the hearts for those that are coming that may not even know they're coming yet. So this is a time for us just to beg and plead with God that he would move once again at our fall revival, that he would change hearts, that we would see people brought out of darkness into light. So join us tonight at 5 p.m. here in the sanctuary as we cry out to God for revival. As we look ahead to the Fall Revival in the Park coming up this next weekend, we have some exciting guests coming. Brad Clonch, who's been with us before, he's coming back to lead worship for us once again. And then also we have Paul Michael Vaca, the pastor of First Baptist Church in Liberty City, Texas. He is coming to uh, bring God's word to us. Uh, I go years back with Paul Michael, and so I'm excited to have him come and bring God's word to us this coming weekend. And so let me just encourage you, invite your friends. It's going to be a great weekend. We've got the Saturday night service at 7 p.m. and we have the Sunday morning service at 11 a.m. And you may have some people in your life, whether it's family, whether it's friends, there may be people in your life that, that maybe they're not ready to step foot in the doors of the church, but they'll come out to the park to join you for the revival services. And so invite them and let's see what God will do as we have friends, family, neighbors, co-workers coming to this revival that weekend. Remember, Sunday morning after the 11 a.m. service, we're gonna have a fellowship meal in the park. And so you are invited to bring your favorite dessert. You're invited to bring your favorite side dish to go along with uh, the meal in the park. And so uh, make plans. Bring those side dishes, bring those desserts so that we can share those together. It's going to be a great weekend. I am so looking forward to worshiping with you at the Fall Revival in the Park next Saturday and Sunday. We have game day coming up this coming Tuesday at 1.30 in the Fellowship Hall. You can make it. That would be wonderful. At 8 a.m. this Saturday, we are having our monthly men's prayer breakfast. So men, get signed up. I always love this time because it's time for us to sit under God's Word, read it, pray together as we grow closer together as men. So get signed up for that. Afterwards, we're going to get our hands a little bit dirty and we're going to bring some chairs over to the park as we prepare for that night for our fall revival. So that is 8 o'clock in the morning in the Fellowship Hall this Saturday. So mark your calendar and begin looking ahead to October 22nd. Sunday night, October 22nd, we are going to have our annual Gambrel Association meeting. So the Gambrel Association is how we partner with local Baptist churches. Churches like First Baptist Lavernia, First Baptist Kennedy, First Baptist Floorsville, and Nixon. And so for our annual Gambrel Association meeting, we're going to be at First Baptist Church Nixon this year. And uh, yours truly, I'm going to bring, be bringing God's Word at that annual meeting. And so let me invite you, come on out October 22nd to First Baptist Nixon in the evening for the Gambrel Association annual meeting. Well, that's it for this week's announcements. For more information, take a look at the bulletin you received on the way in. Now let's continue to worship. <laughs> 